$1.7 trillion to fund the government for next year. Congress approved it today. The Senate barely garnering enough votes to push it through, with most Republicans opposed. President Biden delivering a Christmas address, his message and his warning about the dangerous winter storms bearing down across the U.S. And we'll have economic expert and partner from Crestcat Capital, Tabi Costa, joining us to assess key indicators that determine the fate of the economy. With several installments of the Twitter files now released, the FBI is striking back. The agency says conspiracy theorists are discrediting its reputation.